Get ready. This winter is shaping up to be one of the most memorable in years. Forecasters are predicting a season that's colder and snowier than we've seen in a long time, drawing comparisons to the epic winter of 2013-2014. We're talking about deep, persistent cold and widespread, above-average snowfall, up to 20% more than usual in many regions. This isn't just about a few big storms, it's a season-long pattern that will keep the cold and snow coming. Instead of brief cold snaps, expect long stretches of below average temperatures, especially in the Midwest and Northeast. The snowpack could last for weeks, transforming landscapes and daily routines. Now's the time to prepare. Embrace the challenges and the beauty of a true winter. Let's get ready for some epic winter storms ahead. What's driving this intense winter? It all starts with the jet stream, a powerful river of air high above us. This year the jet stream is expected to buckle, creating deep troughs that open the door for Arctic air to plunge south. Add in a negative Arctic oscillation and the polar vortex weakens, letting frigid air spill into the US. The result? Repeated blasts of bone-chilling cold sweeping from the northern plains to the southeast. This isn't a one-off event, it's a recurring pattern that will define the season. The alignment of these forces makes a cold, snowy winter not just just possible, but likely. So get your warmest gear ready, this winter means business. Winter is arriving early this year, catching many by surprise as the first signs of the season appear before Halloween has even passed. Across much of the country, people are already reaching for their warmest coats and scarves, bracing themselves for what's shaping up to be a memorable start to the cold season. The first blast of cold air will sweep in before October ends, bringing a sudden chill that will have many wondering if winter has skipped fall altogether. The Midwest and Great Lakes will be the first to feel the brunt of this early winter, with temperatures dropping sharply and the first snowflakes swirling through cities like Chicago and Minneapolis. Residents can expect to see their familiar cityscapes transformed overnight as streets and parks take on a wintry look much earlier than usual. Even cities further south, such as Kansas City and St. Louis could be in for a surprise as early snow makes an appearance, dusting rooftops and lawns and signaling that winter is not just for the far north this year. As we move into November, a parade of fast-moving Alberta clippers will sweep across the region. These quick-hitting systems will bring bursts of light to moderate snow keeping roads slick and visibility low, while also reinforcing the cold air that's already settled in. By the time Thanksgiving arrives, many areas stretching from the Dakotas all the way to New England will already be blanketed in above-average snow. Families gathering for the holiday may find themselves shoveling driveways or building snowmen before sitting down to dinner. Lake effect snow belts, think Cleveland Buffalo and Syracuse, are in for a particularly intense start to the season. These areas could see up to 18 inches of snow before November is out, with some spots experiencing near whiteout conditions as cold air rushes over the still warm lakes. Even the southeast will get a taste of winter's early arrival. Frosty mornings will reach as far as the Carolinas, with residents waking up to icy windshields and crisp cold air, a rare sight for this region so early in the season. No region in the east will be immune to this early winter push. From bustling cities to quiet rural towns, the landscape will be transformed by snow and frost, reminding everyone that winter has arrived ahead of schedule and is here to stay for a while. As December arrives, the relentless grip of winter tightens across the northern United States, bringing with it a powerful combination of cold, wind, and snow. Nowhere is this more evident than around the Great Lakes, where the season's first major snowstorms sweep in transforming the landscape into a frozen wonderland. The relatively warm, unfrozen waters of the Great Lakes act as fuel for intense lake effect snow, creating near constant flurries and whiteout conditions. Cities like Buffalo, Erie, and Syracuse are no strangers to these powerful snow bands, but this year, the storms are especially persistent. Multiple heavy events are expected and by Christmas, snow totals could easily exceed four feet in some areas burying neighborhoods and straining local resources. Cleveland and Grand Rapids, too, are bracing for a barrage of snow, with forecasts suggesting close to 30 inches may fall before the month is out. Residents are preparing for a December filled with shoveling, snow plows, and the constant challenge of keeping roads and sidewalks clear. Across the broader Midwest and Plains, the story is much the same. Stubbornly low temperatures and frequent snowfalls will make daily life difficult, especially in cities like Minneapolis and Fargo, where accumulations could reach up to 30 inches. 
rural communities will face low visibility and dangerous travel conditions, with the cold biting deeper as the month progresses. Temperatures throughout the region are expected to run 10 to 15 degrees below normal, plunging many areas into a deep freeze. The frigid air will make even short trips outside a challenge, and the holiday season will be marked by icy winds and snow-packed streets. The Rockies are not spared from winter's wrath. Denver and the surrounding mountains are forecast to receive heavy snow, with totals potentially reaching 25 inches by New Year's. Mountain passes will become treacherous, and the city will be blanketed in white, creating both beauty and hardship for residents. Meanwhile, the East Coast's I-95 corridor is becoming increasingly favorable for major winter storms. New York, Philadelphia, and Washington, D.C. are all in the path of potential nor'easters, with 10 to 15 inches of snow likely to fall. Commuters and city services will be put to the test as snow piles up on busy streets and iconic landmarks. Farther north, Boston and Hartford could see 20 inches or more by month's end as New England braces for repeated rounds of heavy snow. The region's historic towns and cities will be transformed with deep drifts lining the streets and residents digging out after each new storm. For millions across the country December will be a true test of winter resilience, a month defined by determination, community spirit and the enduring challenge of facing nature's coldest, snowiest days. January is the heart of winter, with the coldest and snowiest conditions of the season. A persistent atmospheric block over Greenland will funnel Arctic air deep into the U.S., locking in the cold. Even the South, Nashville, Birmingham, Atlanta, could see snow or dangerous ice. The Great Lakes and Northeast will be buried under heavy snow, with Buffalo likely surpassing 90 inches for the season. Chicago could reach 40 inches, Detroit and Cleveland up to 45 inches, well above average. Boston may be on pace for a 70-inch season, with New York and Philadelphia in the 25 to 35-inch range. Out west, Denver could top 45 inches, Salt Lake City near 60, and the Sierra snowpack could reach 100 inches. This is a month for record-breaking cold and snow. Winter's full force will be on display. February keeps the winter pattern going strong, with no early spring in sight for the Midwest and Northeast. Snow continues to pile up, pushing seasonal totals to historic levels, Chicago near 55 inches, Cleveland and Detroit around 60, and Minneapolis over 70. Buffalo could top 100 inches by mid-month, while Boston approaches 75 inches. The South isn't spared, with Arctic air bringing frost and occasional snow or sleet to Dallas, Oklahoma City, and the Tennessee Valley. Late-season storms can be especially disruptive in areas less prepared for winter weather. By late February, a milder Pacific flow may begin to ease conditions in the west, slowly spreading east. The mountain snowpack will be well above normal, securing water supplies for spring. For most, the transition to spring will be slow after a long, formidable winter. The big picture? This winter is shaping up to be one of the snowiest in recent memory for much of the United States. From coast to coast, communities are bracing for above-average snowfall, with some regions preparing for truly historic totals. Let's break down what you can expect across the country. The Northeast's I-95 corridor, stretching from Washington, D.C. through Philadelphia, New York, and Boston, will see 25-40 inches of snow. This means frequent commutes in challenging conditions and the potential for several major storms to disrupt daily life. Meanwhile, upstate New York and the mountains of northern New England could be buried under 60-90 inches. These areas are no strangers to heavy snow, but this season could bring even more than usual, making travel and outdoor activities especially difficult. The Great Lakes and Midwest are in the bullseye, with 50-80 inches common across cities and rural areas alike. Residents here should prepare for persistent snow cover and the challenges that come with it. In the lake effect snow belts, totals could top 100 inches, with some towns seeing snow pile up faster than plows can keep up. These intense storms can arrive suddenly, making roads treacherous and daily routines unpredictable. The northern plains will see 40-60 inches of dry, powdery snow. This type of snow is easily blown by strong winds, leading to whiteout conditions and drifting that can close roads for days. The central plains will get 20-35 inches, enough to blanket fields and towns but with fewer major storms than farther north. The Rockies and Intermountain West will see 60-100 inches in the mountains. Great news for ski resorts 
resorts and water supplies. Deep snowpack here is vital for spring runoff and recreation, drawing visitors from across the country. The Pacific Northwest lowlands will be wet, with rain dominating the forecast in cities like Seattle and Portland. But in the Cascades, 50-80 inches of snow will transform the mountains into a winter wonderland, perfect for outdoor enthusiasts and critical for regional water resources. The south will see occasional high-impact snow or ice events, which can catch communities off guard and lead to hazardous travel and power outages. The Tennessee Valley and southeast will get 5 to 10 inches, enough for a rare winter scene, but also enough to cause problems where snow is uncommon. Ice storms may be the bigger threat in the south, causing significant disruption to power and transportation, and requiring extra caution from residents. This winter will challenge snow removal crews and test everyone's winter readiness. Whether you're in the heart of a snow belt or just expecting a few flurries, preparation will be key to staying safe and comfortable in the months ahead. The South won't escape winter's reach this year. Arctic air will push deep into the region, bringing hard freezes and the risk of ice from Tennessee to northern Georgia and Alabama. Freezing rain and sleet are the main threats, making roads treacherous and causing power outages in cities like Nashville, Memphis, and Birmingham. Accumulating snow is possible, especially in the higher elevations of Georgia and the Carolinas. Five to 10 inches could bring cities like Atlanta to a standstill. Even Texas and Oklahoma may see light snow or sleet during major Arctic outbreaks. While persistent cold won't define the season here, sharp memorable cold snaps will. The key for the South, be ready for disruptive, if infrequent, winter weather. Preparation is key for a safe, comfortable winter. Check your heating system and seal drafts to keep the cold out and energy bills down. Dress in layers, base, insulating, and waterproof outer layers, plus a hat, gloves, scarf, and insulated boots. Ready your vehicle. Check tires, battery, antifreeze, and keep a winter emergency kit with blankets, snacks, water, and a shovel. Always check the weather before traveling and allow extra time. Stay informed with local forecasts and weather alerts on your phone. Knowing when storms are coming lets you prepare and stay safe. With a little planning, you can enjoy all the beauty and fun this epic winter has to offer.